Hey guys, welcome back. Houston Math Prep here. In this video, we're going to be solving a quadratic equation by completing the square. And specifically in this one, we're going to look at what happens if our b variable does not evenly divide by 2. So we'll always start out the same way by moving our current constant over to the other side. In this case, that leaves us with x squared plus 3x equals negative 1. And then we're going to be adding a constant onto both sides to create a perfect square trinomial on the left. So creating that perfect square trinomial, we follow the process of taking b, dividing it by 2, and squaring it. In this case, our b is 3. So we have 3 divided by 2 squared. Now 3 does not evenly divide by 2, so we'll just go ahead and square, and that gives us 9 over 4. So 9 over 4 is going to be the constant that we add to both sides to create our perfect square trinomial. So when your b value is odd, you're going to get a fraction as what you add. After that, the process remains the same. Our left-hand side is a perfect square trinomial that we can use our middle value to factor through. So this would factor to x plus 3 halves squared. And on the left-hand side, we want to combine. So if I got a common denominator there, that would be negative 4 over 4 plus 9 over 4 to get 5 over 4. Now taking the square root of both sides to get rid of our squared, we get x plus 3 over 2 equals plus or minus, don't forget, you gotta take plus or minus, square root of five over, square root of four is two. So square root of five over two. Now, subtracting that three over two from both sides, we get x equals negative three over two plus or minus root five over two. Or, since they already have a common denominator, you could write that as negative 3 plus or minus root 5 over 2. Alright guys, that does it for this video. We'll catch you in the next one.